Hello, welcome to my workshop. So in today's video, I want to show you how to make a very simple ergonomic push stick. And all you really need is a piece of wood and some Play-Doh. Stick around, I'll show you how to do it. Okay, so first you want to begin by taking the Play-Doh out of the container and make a very simple log out of the Play-Doh. Once you have it about that size, you want to take the hand that you typically use for your push stick and just squeeze. And you don't want to squeeze too much because you do want to have a little bit of meat in there. So then gently take it out and then take your piece of Play-Doh and stick it down at the end of your board. And what you're going to want to do is try to trace it the best you can. Once you've traced it, you can kind of clean up your edges. So I've always liked Matthias Waddell's version of his push stick. Now you can find the template for this in the description below. That's off of his website, woodgears.ca. And what we're going to do is take the end of this and add it to our board. And now we'll just cut it out on the bandsaw. And then I'll give it a good sanding and then give it a round over on my router. Okay, so there we have it. Kind of looks like a pocket knife, but my hand fits perfectly around there and I have no fatigued. <laughs> so, like I said, all you needed was some simple Play-Doh to form the mold for your hand, and then your piece of wood, cut it. You don't have to use a band saw, you can use a coping saw. You don't even have to use a sander or a router. You can just go with the edge or you can sand it with some sandpaper. Do whatever you want. But I hope you found that enjoyable. Also, hope that you found it helpful. Maybe you're going to want to make it yourself. Um, you know, I might actually, uh, I might make more of these. Maybe you'll find these on my Etsy store. So stay tuned for some updates maybe down the road if I decide to sell these. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.